Welcome to this tutorial. Today, we're gonna learn how to create a Johnny Harris style map animation in After Effects. By the end of this video, you'll be able to make dynamic and engaging map animations that look professional, even if you're a beginner. This style became popular thanks to Johnny Harris, a journalist and filmmaker who combines documentary storytelling with clean, modern graphics. His maps are visually striking because they are simple, easy to read, and dynamic. They guide the viewer through a story in a way that feels both informative and cinematic. Many creators love this style because it instantly adds a professional touch to their videos. First, we start by creating a new composition in After Effects. Choose the resolution and frame rate that matches your project. This will be the base where all of our animation and effects will take place, so it's important to set it up properly from the beginning. Next, we need a map. You can download a map from the internet or use high quality stock maps. After importing it into After Effects, add it to your composition and adjust the size to fit the frame. Then, choose the specific region you want to focus on. This will be the main area that the camera will zoom into later. Now, we'll create a camera. The camera allows us to simulate movement, such as zooming and panning across the map, which is key to this style. You can adjust the camera settings according to your project. We'll show the recommended settings on the screen in the video. To control the camera more easily, we'll create a null layer. Parenting the camera to this null layer allows you to move, rotate, or zoom the camera smoothly. For this tutorial, we'll zoom into Germany. The null layer makes it simple to animate the camera from the starting point to the focused region. After the camera movement is set, it's time to highlight the country's borders. Duplicate your map layer and double-click it to enter the layer panel. Using the brush tool, carefully outline the region you want to highlight. This will create a clean, hand-drawn look for the border, just like Johnny Harris does in his animations. Return to the main composition and select the layer with your brush strokes. Enable paint on transparent so only the drawn lines are visible without the map underneath. Change the stroke color to white and adjust the thickness of the lines until it looks clean and clear on your map. Next, animate the borders to make them appear gradually. In the transform settings, create two keyframes for opacity. One at 0% at the beginning, and another at 100% at the point where the border should be fully visible. This will create a smooth, cinematic fade-in effect for the highlighted region. Now, let's add a shape layer with the country's name. Position it near the highlighted region and animate it to appear alongside the border. You can use the free Mister Horse plugin to add smooth text animations, which will make the title feel more dynamic and visually appealing.
To give the animation a cinematic or slightly vintage feel, you can add effects like noise and posterized time. Additionally, create a layer with a blurred mask around the edges to simulate camera focus, which helps direct the viewer's attention to the highlighted region. These small details make the animation feel more professional. And that's it. Our map animation is ready. You now have a dynamic, clean, and stylish animation that even beginners can achieve in After Effects. You can use this technique for storytelling, documentaries, or any project where a visually engaging map is needed.